Alrighty, my name is Dominic Pruitt. I'm with IBM Sales and Distribution, and we're going to take a look at the user interface changes that Tivoli Storage Productivity Center went through. Uh, what you see on the screen here is version 5.2.3.0, and just I'll briefly look at this is what the dashboard for the storage management interface looks like. We have some icons on the left that, you know, when we hover over, give us additional choices. Home, storage resources, server resources, and then we have our you know, area in the middle here where information is presented. So if I actually go to you know, storage subsystems, I can actually take a look at the uh, systems that I'm connected to. And so the major change between 523 and 524 is really the menu change over here on the left. That's going to move to the top. All right, so let me go ahead and log out of here and go to a 524 system. All right. All right, now you're looking at the same thing, same dashboard. PC product 524. Now the actual menu choices have moved to the top. You'll see some very familiar ones of those. So the icons are gone, but I have choices here dashboard, performance monitor, alert, task, system management, and then storage subsystems, volumes. So if I select storage subsystems like I did before, you'll see the look and feel of the submenus have changed have not changed. So servers, hypervisors, network switches, fabrics groups, applications, and departments. This is new for 524. Advanced analytics, this was the same in 523. Cognos, so now the reporting label is changed to Cognos, but we still have the same choices. A few predefined reports, create capacity, create performance, and then settings. Alert notifications, history retention, user management. And then last but not least, the splash screen for the code base. Uh, 5241 came out in December of 2014. Alright, that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks.